Good morning, kids. Good morning, kids. <laughs> See the dog that came down to help me. The format looks a little funny. I'm filming on my phone. After this workout, I'm headed to Texas. So I, uh, I can't stick around the four hours it takes to upload a video. So I'm going to put it on my phone, and then when I get to a place with decent internet, I'll upload it then. So you'll... You just won't see the awesome out artwork I've been doing on my thumbnails. Anyways, max effort day, wrist wrench, three and three eighths, um, tables parallel. We're starting at 100 pounds. I got down here earlier before I turned the phone on and started at 40. So I worked from 40 up to 100. And actually, I did, I did one rep at 100 before I even turned the camera on. Phone on. Camera phone on. Now, since I came out of the fog, my highs are slightly higher, and my lows are just as low. That's a wild improvement on the average mean so. Right is sore, the left is weak. <sighs> Even though the right hurts, it's definitely stronger. But all right, one ten. No longer choking on. Weeks now since I came out of the fog. I just like why. The lows are just as low. It's a mild improvement on the average even so. It's hitting me right there. Very odd, very odd, very odd, very odd. So, we'll cover this later, but I bought this notebook. This notebook's, all the pages are falling out of this notebook, man. It's basically a stack of loose paper for some reason. I bought brand new notebooks, but I'm not a, I'm switching over after this weekend. I'll, uh, do this. This is just a cheap notebook's like 90 cents, and an expensive notebook's like $2. And the expensive notebook doesn't fall apart. I have no idea why I bought such a cheap note, such a cheap composition book. Because I'm an idiot. No longer choking on the hair of the dog.
Shouldn't hurt up there. Ha! <sighs> it was those 95 pound hammer curls yesterday. Oh well. What you gonna do? Stop showing off. Of course, I did it on both arms, so that doesn't quite make sense, does it? That's what my left was. Yeah. Back on September 8th, the first time we tried 120, I didn't get it. And then I barely got it. Like on the second time. Uh, 130. Thirty pounds. One thirty, one thirty, one thirty. Easy weight, easy weight, easy weight. Try a PR on the left of 125. Ouch. Ouch. So I took a pint of whiskey and I poured it down the sink. To myself, I looked up at your picture and I knocked it off the shelf. Mm, every little bit counts. All right, 125 will be a PR if we hit it. Not that anybody cares. Actually, my left feels like it'll hit a PR today, and my right feels like it's gonna. Take the afternoon off. <sighs> Been a couple of weeks now since I came out of the fog.
boom like that. Five pounds on my left in a month. All right, now we gotta figure out what we're gonna do here. I'd like to go to 130, 137 and a half on the right. My PR on the right last time was 140, and 142 and a half did not budge. So I'm not going to try 140 right now. We're going to go to 137 and a half, which is under the PR, and then we'll jump from 137 and a half to 142 and a half, which is a five pound jump. But it'll be a two and a half improvement on the PR. Uh, a couple of weeks now. Thirty-seven point try and push the left up again and get greedy or you just try to repeat the 125 PR which is five pounds the left is nowhere near the right the temptation is to try to push it to 130 <sighs> but <sighs> I don't want to get my whole central nervous system too tired because I really want to hit this right <sighs> But then I got this time to fill in while I rest. <laughs> so I don't know what to do with the camera. Uh, I think we'll just try the 125 again. Uh, and stuff they make magnetic weights they make weights that weigh like one and a quarter and two and a half pounds and they're magnets you can like stick them to dumbbells or stick them to this pin sack they're pretty handy I don't have any and I don't have any dumbbells or kettlebells <clears throat> I have the play it again sports weight set so there's like five different brands of plates I got a whole pile of plates here with a little tiny like inch and inch or inch and a quarter hole in it <clears throat> This might 
go down as a bad decision to try another left instead of just resting to try to hit that right. But eh, it's all about time under tension, right, folks? is no doubt a legit 125. I did it twice. I probably could have done 127 and a half. But when I write down that I did it again, in a month or so when we come back there, I'll know that was pretty easy. All right. Let's try a PR on the right. The right's not ready yet. It's still barking at me. Just as low. It's a mild improvement on the average, even so. I'm gonna write down 142.5 PRA. Personal record attempt. Well, this Saturday, I'm in Lindale, Texas. Stop by and say hi. Oh. I'll be the one sweating like a lawn sprinkler. Probably have a backpack full of hotel towels. This 142 and a half will be at PR today, but it's not my all time. I don't think. <sighs> yeah, I've done 145 before. I think I did 145 for one of those. What everybody was doing like an Uncle John's Max video or something back in June, July, but that was several years ago. Anyways, I'll be into the 150 here no, pretty soon because I'll keep this up because my next match looks like it's going to be another inside match. So I'll keep pushing this up. So I'll get to 150 here pretty soon. All right, all right, all right, all right. 142.5. Easy way, easy way, easy way, easy way. I ought to just throw 145 on there and just be bam. <sighs> Been a couple of weeks now since I came out of the fog. There we go, boys and girls. Really wasn't even that hard. I don't think I could have done 145. I think I could have done 143. But, training's working. 
what is it, 9, 9, 8 to 10, 8 is uh, 4 weeks, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. So let's say 5 weeks, added 2.5 pounds on a 140-ish lift. So that's like 2% in 5 weeks. It's not bad. All right. Go tell your family you love them. Do something nice. Like, if you run into one of your friends in the sh shopping in the grocery store, don't stand in the middle of aisle gabbing with your cart blocking all kinds of traffic. Go out to the big aisle, man. The rest of us got shopping to do too. Okay. See you in Texas. About four days.